Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover what it means when we have a number next to a variable. So we are going to take a look at evaluating expressions where we have a number next to a variable. Now when we evaluate an expression, we find the value of the expression, so what it equals once we work through it. As far as a number next to a variable, simply put, it means to multiply. Let's jump into our examples and see exactly what this looks like, starting with number 1 where we have 8x. We have a number 8 next to a variable x. This means they are being multiplied, so we have 8 times x. The first thing that we need to do in order to evaluate this expression, we need to replace or plug in the given value for the variable. This is called substitution. For the examples in this video, we are going to evaluate for when x equals 9 and y equals 2. So let's plug in 9 for x and rewrite this expression. We have 8 times x, well, x equals 9, so let's plug in 9 for x, then multiply. 8 times 9 equals 72. The value of this expression is 72 when x equals 9. One thing I do want to mention about plugging values in for variables when we have a number next to a variable, make sure to use something to represent multiplication. For example, I used a dot. We cannot put two numbers next to each other in order to represent multiplication. For example, in number 1, if we were to put the 8 and the 9 next to each other, that would look like 89. That does not mean 8 times 9. When we have a number next to a variable or a variable next to a variable, that does represent multiplication though. So something to keep in mind. Let's move on to number 2 where we have 3xy. So we have a number next to two variables. This still means multiplication. We have 3 times x times y. Let's evaluate this expression. So let's plug in and go from there. We have 3 times x, x equals 9, so plug in 9 for x, times y, y equals 2, so plug in 2 for y. Now we can multiply, and I'm going to work from left to right, starting with 3 times 9, which is 27. Bring down the multiplication sign and the 2 we did not use. We end with 27 times 2, which equals 54. The value of this expression is 54 when x equals 9 and y equals 2. So there you have it. There's what it means when we have a number next to a variable. We multiply. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.